Hello guys, this is Indian Medico and in this video we are going to see about Trachunculus medinensis. This is a concise presentation for medical students. Trachunculus medinensis is a nematode. It is also known as guinea worm. It causes guinea worm disease or trachunculiasis. This disease is found in a few countries in sub-Saharan Africa. This picture shows a female Trachunculus medinensis. This is a male Trachunculus medinensis. Now let us see about the life cycle of Trachunculus. The definitive host is man. The intermediate host is cyclops. The infective form is third stage pyloriform lava. The mode of transmission is by drinking fresh water from stagnant pools containing minute freshwater crustaceans that is cyclops infected with L3 larvae. Now let us see about the clinical features of trachunculiasis. It starts as painful papule. This gets converted into a blister from which the worm emerges. This picture shows the blister from which worm emerges in a case of trachunculiasis. The disease is more common between June to September. It is found in regions with poor socio-economic development. Now let us see about the diagnosis of Dracunculiasis. Microscopic detection of L1 larvae and adults on contact with cold water placed on the leg ulcer is used for the diagnosis of Dracunculiasis. How do you treat a case of Dracunculiasis? Worm removal should be done and symptomatic treatment should be given to the patient. This picture shows worm removal in a case of Dracunculiasis. Now let us see about the eradication of Dracunculiasis from India. Dracunculiasis has been eliminated from India since the year 2000. This was achieved by National Guinea Worm Eradication Program which was implemented in 1984. The following things were done for eradication of Dracunculiasis. Provision of safe drinking water by filtration, installing hand pumps, pipes, boreholes and wells. Cyclops control was done by application of abate larvicide. Health education was given to people regarding boiling and filtering of drinking water. And cases were treated properly so that Trachunculus medinensis was eliminated from India. If you have any suggestions, please let me know in the comment section. For more such videos, please check out my parasitology playlist. Thank you.